Angers and Rennes kicked off the weekend action at the Stade Jean Bouin on Friday night. Newly promoted Angers have surprised everyone so far this season, but three games without a victory had threatened to halt their rise. Rennes were also desperate for three points after following a four-match winning streak with a seven-game winless run. They didn't start like a side out of form though and took the lead with just over three minutes gone. Pedro Enrique's wicked right-wing cross was met by a bullet header from Abdoulaye Ducouré. The midfielder has been a bright spark for Philippe Montagnier's men in recent weeks and that was his third goal in six outings. Giovanni Gisio started the season in fine fettle before a red card halted his momentum. But the Angers defence could do nothing to stop this surging run, only for the Ivorian to drag his efforts wide. Rennes had won the only previous meeting between the two teams, a 2014 Coupe de France match, and looked well on their way to repeating the trick at half-time. Tom Mangani's free kick 10 minutes into the second half was headed as far as Abdul Kamara. The forward's ambitious left-footed shot threatened the top corner, but didn't find it. Just after the hour mark, the visitors doubled their advantage. Johan Andrew could only clear a corner to the edge of the area and midfielder Jelson Fernandez drilled his effort low past Ludovic Butel. A first league goal for the Swiss international since he scored for Freiburg in the Bundesliga two years ago. Angers though were given a lifeline in the 81st minute when Kamil Grosicki's clumsy foul on Vincent Monso gave away a penalty. Mongani has scored three set pieces this season, but on this occasion Benoit Costil kept out his poor spot kick. Angers nil, Rennes 2, the final score.